Hello, bonjour, comment ça va? Today we're talking about virtual desktop 1.10 update. Let's go! Welcome back to VR Essentials, where we talk about the practical uses of VR. My name is Lazius K, and today we're talking about the update of virtual desktop. 1.10. Now, if you're familiar with virtual desktop timestamps in the description below, you can skip this step. Otherwise, let me give you a little intro. Virtual desktop is a platform that enables you to stream anything from your PC completely remotely to your Oculus Quest. Now, this was re-released back in May by Guy Godin. It's so popular that in June it was banned from the Oculus Store and any updates had to be made via SideQuest. If you want to know a little bit more about SideQuest and how to install it, watch until the end of this video as I'll give you a little bit more insights. Virtual Desktop is a serious piece of technology because it enables you to stream anything from your computer onto a VR headset. This means you can choose different environments where you can play your favorite video games in a gigantic cinema, for example, or you can stream VR experiences that aren't available in the Oculus Quest store. So perhaps they're only available on Steam or on the Oculus Rift store or various other different platforms. You can watch all your favorite movies and so much more. To get Virtual Desktop 1.0 up and running, here's all you need to do. First of all, make sure that you go to Virtual Desktop's website and download the installer for your PC and of course purchase the app in your Oculus Quest. Once you've done that, plug in your Oculus Quest into your computer so that it's connected to SideQuest. If SideQuest is telling you that you're disconnected from your SideQuest or you can't find it, make sure to pair your headset with your phone and that you go into more settings, developer, and enable developer mode. For those who have a previous version of virtual desktop installed in SideQuest, make sure that you delete your current install and reinstall the latest version of virtual desktop so that you can download version 1.10 into your Oculus Quest. Now simply go inside of your Oculus Quest into unknown app launcher and find virtual desktop within the SideQuest app launcher. After you launch it, you'll see at the bottom, it should say version 1.10. Now, if you find that after doing this installation, it still doesn't update, there is a brute force way of doing it. Again, make sure that you delete the current install that you just made, then go to the link description below to the GitHub page and download the APK. All you then have to do is go back into SideQuest, click on the icon where you can upload manually the APK and do the install that way. There are several videos that I have done comparing the graphics between Oculus Link and Virtual Desktop. Do go and check those videos in the link description below. Before I give you my final thoughts on Virtual Desktop and how you can get hold of SideQuest easily, I just want to give a very quick shout out to all those who went to watch the previous video, which is all about Apple potentially launching the iQuest and how Oculus could learn from Apple's previous historical marketing campaigns in driving more revenue and getting more people into VR. You guys are awesome. Virtual Desktop is a great alternative for those who want to watch their favorite movies or play their favorite video games within VR without having the constraints to be hooked up to a PC. And of course, it's also good for those who either don't want to get the Oculus Link or who don't have a PC ready VR computer at this moment in time. So they fixed a lot of the different bugs, including latency and a whole heap of different things. Link in description below to all the different bugs that they managed to fix. And also there are certain games that are not compatible with the latest version. Link in description below to the full list of those games. And I highly recommend that you join their Discord, of course. You can just go to their website and then click on the Discord. You'll find the address there. Installing SideQuest is really easy. First of all, all you have to do is go to the Oculus developers website and create a developer's account it doesn't take long, you just have to fill up a few things. Then go to SideQuestVR.com's website and install the latest download. Once you've done that, you're pretty much done. I'd like to thank you for watching this video. Remember to like and subscribe to the channel so that you and I together we can grow the community and help as many people in VR here because that is what it's all about. All right, until next time, take it easy. And as always, DJ, take it away. Woo.